All right, so I guess it's important to make sure you have internet service when you go live. Uh, I just attempted um, going live over at the labyrinth, the prayer labyrinth, one street over at the church we attend, and it was a bit of a mess. Um, not only because there wasn't great internet service, but also because of my ADHD brain. But to focus a tad, one way to use a prayer labyrinth is to um, walk into the middle of the prayer labyrinth with your fists closed, like with your hands and fists, and thinking about things that you want to let go of. And then when you get to the middle of the prayer labyrinth, you can um, open up your hands and breathe and say a prayer if you like. Um, or just say out loud or whisper the things that you want to release. And then as you leave the center of the prayer labyrinth, continue to kind of meditate on those things that you want to release. Or you can do what I did today and go live and <laughs> show people that you're walking out of a prayer labyrinth. Um, if you don't have a prayer labyrinth one block over from your house, there are other prayer labyrinth resources that I can share in the stories later this morning. Um, there are a few websites that list different labyrinths um, in different locations. So you can search based on city and state and that sort of thing to see what kind of labyrinths are near you. Also, there are paper labyrinths that you can trace like with your finger or um, like a pencil eraser or something. Um, there are pro probably like printable labyrinths, to be honest, kind of like coloring pages, but a labyrinth that you can print out and use. There's also, I have a couple of wooden labyrinths where it's, um, like a piece of wood and the labyrinth has been like carved out and you use your finger to trace the path of the labyrinth. So there are different resources out there if you don't, if you aren't near a, um, one that you can walk in. So I will share some of those resources and um, maybe a couple of other ways to use labyrinths. And thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a good day.